You probably have always wondered how to make your ZBrush models animation ready and prepare them for texturing. How to make this retopologizing step that everybody is talking about. How to make this jump from a couple of million polygons to just a few thousand. So animation and entering in EM engine will be possible. All those questions and more will be answered in this course. My name is Nico and I'm a 3D character artist for more than a decade now. I have made a numerous characters for numerous games and for all of them, I've used this style of retopologizing and UV mapping that I will show you in this course. Using the retopology and UV unwrap tools that come default with 3D Max, we will make a cartoon character and also UV unwrap it. So it's ready for texturing and baking in Substance Painter, which we will do in another course. As a bonus, I will show you how to make a production animation ready uh, retopology and UV mapping of a head with open mouth and also a realistic hand. In this course, we will learn preparing your mesh in ZBrush for export, exporting your meshes from ZBrush and import them into 3D Max, basics of 3D Max needed for retopology, how to start the retopology of a character, retopologizing tricks and hints, basics of 3D Max UV unwrap, hints and tips on efficient and quality unwrapping of a character, exporting a high poly realistic head from ZBrush and importing it into 3D Max, retopologizing a realistic head with loops in the right places ready for animation, making a good and useful UV map of a human head, retopology of a human hand, UV mapping of a human hand, and also some interesting random artistic stuff when we are doing something repetitive. We will start in ZBrush, where we will spend some time to organize, merge and prepare the high poly meshes for export. Then we will decimate the high poly, so we can import it in 3D Max without too much performance issues. We will see how to export meshes from ZBrush and import them into 3D Max. Then we will get familiar with the retopology tools and get some basic knowledge about 3D Max. After that, we will start the retopology from the head and horns and then going through every separate pieces we have like arms, shoulders, cape and legs. As we go, I will tell you how I do retopology and how I approach the problems when retopologizing. We will then get familiar with the UV unwrapping capabilities embedded in 3D Max and we will start unwrapping the character piece by piece and checking the unwrap with the checker texture. When we finish, we will arrange all the pieces in a square texture space like a puzzle. When we are done with that, we will export a realistic head from ZBrush and import it in 3D Max so we can start making it its topology. We will make a topology which is animation friendly and also include the inside of the mouth. Next will be of course making the UV unwrapping of the head, in which I will show you how to use ZBrush as a very good unwrapping tool too. We will do all the steps again for realistic hand too. I made this course for absolute retopology beginners and no previous knowledge of 3D Max is required. I made this course in 3D Max because I always made my retopologies and UV mapping there. I think it's a pretty good software for the purpose and I'm ready to prove it. So see you in the first video of the course.